Dun, 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 dun. Hello everybody, yes, we are started again. We are here to continue our uh, journey of learning English. We can do this. We were, we were learning about King Alfred the Great in previous time and now the Vikings. The Vikings, I need to do some music on the background because we have so loudly neighbor, wall neighbors. One moment, I will open. Ludovica Ivaldi one hour special for me. Two children were playing on the banks of the river near the town of the Londinium. Londinium. The boy's name was Alric. The girl was called Freda. They were playing a game in the mud. What is mud? In the mud, a cold wind blew across the water. Alric and Freda shivering in their wet clothes. We must go home, said Freda. It is getting late. Mother and father will be worried and cross. Suddenly, Alric jumped up. What have I set on? He asked. Have I set on a thorn? It is very sharp. Alric has had a look at it. It is a spare, spare head. He, he said, it is not an English spare head. It looks like a Viking spare head. Spare, spear head. Spear head. Freda felt afraid. Her friends had told her stories about the Vikings. They were big men like giants. Their spears and Axes were sharp. Axes. Axes. Axes were sharp. They burned down villages and killed people. Freda had once seen the, their long boats. Long boats. On the river. Now she looked up and down the river. Suddenly she saw something. It was a long black boat. Oh, look, said Freda to Alric. There is a boat on the river. Alric started stared at the long boat. He could see strange men in it. There were there were round shields along the side of the boat. On the prow of the boat was carved like a dragon's head. Prow Prow The sail was black On one, one of the men wore a golden helmet. Vikings, said Alric, hide, Freda. The children were terrified. They both fell flat in the grass. They heard the sound of splashing oars. They heard the boat slide onto the mud. Then a deep voice spoke close by. Children, said the voice. Alric and Freda looked up. Freda started to cry. Started to cry. Alric shivering, shivered with fear. The man in the golden helmet stood near them. What are you doing? He said. His voice was strange. He spoke their language badly. He was the Viking chef. The boat was close to the bank, and more Vikings were getting out. They came over to Alric and Freda. Alric held Freda's hand. We will tell you nothing, he said bravely. You're a bad man. My mother said so. You burned down villages. The Viking laughed. No, we are good men, he said. We have come to trade with your village. Take us to your village. Look, we had a fine swords and spears. And spears, yes. We will give them to your people. They will give us a cattle in exchange. No, said Fred, I don't trust you. The Viking lifted them up. He put them in the boat. Wait there, he said. I will find your father. He will tell you that we are your friends. The, Viking, the Vikings went up along the bank. One man stayed to look after the children. Alric spoke softly to his sister. Talk them to the man. Keep his busy. Fred and the Viking sat on one end of the boat. Alric sat at the other the uh, at the other end. He still had the spear hut. He still had the spear hut. 
he dug it into the bottom of the boat, soon water began to creep in. Ulrich had made, had made a hole in the boat's planks. He dug again and the hole got bigger. Water rushed in. What have you done? shouted the Viking. He put the children onto the bank. He jumped out of the boat. Soon the boat was full of water. It lay on its side on the mud bottom. There was a shot behind them. It was Freda's father and the chief Viking. What have you done? father shouted. You have sunk my friend's butt. We thought they were bad men, said Alric. Freda started to cry again. Tears ran down her muddy face, but the man in the golden helmet laughed out loud. Vikings are not all bad, he said. You must not listen to all of the silly stories. Then I am sorry about your boat, said Alric. We can make it float again, said the chef. When it is flowing again, we will take your four and ride in it. We will go up on the river to Landile. Landinium. Freda stopped crying. She began to smile. That will be good, she said. I think I will be a Viking chief when I grow up. Tell the story using the words in bracket. The children. Okay, they found. They found Freda felt afraid she had heard about Vikings. The children played. They found. Uh, they found. Beer, beer hat, or how to say it, correct? Spear hat. They found spear hat. Freda felt afraid. She had heard about Vikings. They were giants. They were big humans. They were big humans. They were big men like giants. Yes, they're. Uh, their spears and axes were sharp. They, da, 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 they burned. How to say it? Correct. They, 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 they. One moment, need to upload video. It will be super fast. They burned villages. They burned down villages and uh, killed people. Suddenly, Fred is so. Long black boat. There were strange people in a the boat. There were round shields along the side of the boat. The sail was black. One of the men wore a golden helmet. The man was the Viking chef. He said, We have come. We have come to sell, to trade, to trade with your village. Take us to. To village. To your village. We will give swords and spears to your people. They will give us. Will give us cattle in exchange. The children. Let's see it. The children did not agree. The Viking. The Viking feel. The Viking lifted them up 
and put them in the boat. In a boat. Alric. Alric had made a hole by the spearhead into the bottom of the boat. Water creep in. Began to creep in. The boat Sunk. What happened after the boat had sunk? After the boat had sunk, Viking met father of the, of the of these children, and uh, father said that is his friend. And uh, that's all, nothing else. After that, that Viking is his friend and he came to trade things. And after that, children said to, said to Viking that they will create brand new bot to him. What questions would uh, you ask Alec and Freda? Are you are you virgins? Act out the story if you liked it. Yeah, what's this? I'm a man who goes to the boat. Oh my God, a spearhead! What need to do with it? Do you know? Do you know what need to do with it? Are you? Are you know it? It is. Yeah, and also you can hear some of the uh, laughing and uh, not pitch it, pitch it notes on the ground. Mud in the mud. I don't know what is mud. Need to Google it. Yes, good story. I think need to find some mud, mud, or how to say it, mud. Mud it will be. It is mud. Uh, we'll be worried and cross. Okay, let's uh, read it again. Two children were playing on the banks on the river near the town of the Lantinium. The boy's name was Arlick, the girl was called Freda. They were playing a game in the mud. A cold wind blew across the water. Alec, had, Alec and Freda shivered in their wet clothes. We must go home, said Freda. It is getting late. Mother and father will be worried and cross. Suddenly Alec jumped up. What have I set on? He said. Asked. Have I set on a thorn? It uh, is uh, very sharp. Alec had to look at it. It is a spear head, he said. It is not an English spearhead, it looks like a viking, a viking spearhead. Well, how to say it, uh, viking. Viking, sea king. Yes. Mud. To sing. Wow. 
one more word to flood to flood is floating it is straight on the water keeping to trade to trust to creep in Yes, you know. The crown. Bro. Out oh, the butt. It is like a toy. Spearhead. Good. Good. We we did it. Done. Sixteen. Yeah, nice job, I think. Yes, William the Conqueror will be next. But before, I should uh, open our list of words. Daver Via wire by using the internet. To settle. Settle a result or reach an agreement about. Resolve or reach an agreement about the scent, the origin or background of a person in terms of family or nationally. Former haven't previously filled a particular role of being a particular thing. Gratifying, pleasurable. MGR manager. That was a one hell of a ride. A life of experience full of adventure. The tour took a long of round the road. Fairer, intense and passionate feeling to possess is known. Oh, Jesus, to possess this. Own.
in terms of family or nation. Okay. Nationality. Warmer.
Yes, we did. Our learning is ended. Thanks so much for everybody who was watching. I really pleased. I really glad. I'm really glad to work with you, my dear viewers. My dear viewers. And don't forget to improve yourself daily. Yes, it is simple rule. Simple rule for daily activity is improving. Small pieces every day. Thanks so much. See you next time. Bye bye. Yes, click to this video and